There are so many options when it comes to cookware that it can be overwhelming when deciding which one to choose. And since you get the most bang for your buck when buying in sets, it's important to know what you're investing in. I'm Belle from the Williams Sonoma Test Kitchen and today I'm gonna to break it all down to help you decide which cookware is right for you. So let's start with the basics. A good stainless steel set is probably your best bet for basic all around cooking. I use mine every single day, but not all stainless is made the same. For all stainless steel, you wanna look for 1810 stainless, which will provide a cooking surface that won't react with any foods, even super acidic foods like tomatoes and citrus. At Williams-Sonoma, we commonly carry three ply and five ply stainless steel. This speaks to the number of layers in the pan. Three ply stainless is usually sufficient for your basic cooking needs, especially if you're newer in the kitchen. And like all stainless, it's really easy to clean and maintain. Whether three ply or five ply, these stainless steel pans are great for overall cooking, whether it's browning meats, oven to table dishes, and even delicate sauces. Next up is copper. First of all, it's really pretty. But second of all, copper is another great option for cookware because it's one of the best conductors of heat. It heats up really quickly and also reacts to any change in heat. So it's good for delicate sauces or anything where you need precise temperature control. I use it a lot for lemon curds and risottos, things like that. Copper is a little more high maintenance when it comes to cleaning. It can tarnish a little bit as it's on the heat, but it actually makes a really beautiful finish. If you want that shiny, out of the box feel, you'll just have to polish it more often. Now there are two types of cast iron, seasoned and enameled. I love my enameled Dutch oven because it's great for stews, soups, and braises. It goes from stovetop to oven beautifully and also straight to the table. Plus the enameled coating doesn't rust like a season, so it's really easy to maintain. These are durable and long lasting and they come in a lot of very pretty colors. A cast iron skillet is one of my must haves in the kitchen. It's very durable and although it heats up slower, once it gets hot, it stays hot. I like to use it for searing meat. I even like to make pizzas on it since it goes from the stove top to the oven beautifully. And once you learn to season it properly, it will last you a lifetime. Some of my absolute favorite pots and pans are my nonstick. It's great for cooking anything with any sticky marinade or sauce because it won't make a mess in your pan and it's really easy to clean. You just wanna make sure you look for any nonstick coating that's PFOA free. It definitely takes some hard cooking time to decide which cookware is right for you. So it helps to consider a few things. How much time you spend in the kitchen, what you're actually cooking, and how much time you're willing to give to the upkeep of your pots and pans. To find out more about which cookware is right for you, check out our cookware buying guide at williamsnoma.com.